एवरीवन टुडे वी हैव विद अस डॉक्टर शोभोजीत शर्कर असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर फ्रॉम द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ फिजिक्स एट ब्रेनवे यूनिवर्सिटी डॉक्टर शर्कर हैज रिसेंटली रिसीव्ड द डीएसटी एसीआरबी स्टार्टअप रिसर्च ग्रांट 2023 सो नाउ लेट अस हैव अ चैट विद हिम हेलो सर इट्स अ प्लेजर टू हैव यू सो माय फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन टू यू इज इफ यू कुड प्लीज एक्सप्लेन द प्रोजेक्ट दैट यू आर वर्किंग ऑन इन सिंपल टर्म्स फॉर द स्टूडेंट्स या श्योर सो actually what this project is all about is about few layers of atomically thin materials now when i say atomically thin uh, what does that mean so it is thinner let's say 80000 1 over 80000 times thinner than a human hair so already human hair is like i mean pretty thin right but then we have a material whose thickness is i mean like 80000 times less than the thickness of a hair but it can have its own width and breadth but it doesn't have any as such height or in the thickness now why such materials are important now people tr- i mean like physicist and other scientists they are trying they have been trying since last 20 years also to you know prepare such a material which they believe and still we i mean that time people believe that it exist but there was no realization realization means experimental production so around 2004 so first two british physicists they came up with a single layer of carbon which is known as graphene which is an, an wonderful material now why this is a wonderful material because again this is a very thin as thin amount thinner than the human hair but extremely strong how strong Two to four full size, full grown elephant can stand on it. Still, it will not tear. So, as thin, I mean, hard is it? It has very high conductivity. Now, when I say conductivity, that means its uh, electricity can flow through it seamlessly without much friction and uh, other disturbance. And moreover, it's transparent. So, if I can make a material out of, uh, I mean, like any uh, product out of this material, then I can see through. that's wonderful for example like window of uh, uh, airplane which is mostly uh, i mean uh, you know made up of titanium oxide which is a different material but we can also use this graphene so around this 2004 tremendous research started in this field and it started not only from the experimental point of view but as well as from the theoretical point of view that is to understand the properties in from different perspective and all that research findings will uh, help or contribute in the advancement of technologies like data storage or electronics devices you mentioned sure i um, mean so let's say i mean my primary objective of this study is mostly theoretical point of view which is fundamental type like to know why a particular player interacts in particular way or rather why it doesn't interact in an you know anticipated way however as you said i mean it's very true that if research remains within the wall of a lab that is not of use of any kind so we must bring it to the industry so that in every day life we can use some gadget or some application And uh, any advice you may have for the students who are aspiring to pursue research, or um, how do you see the future of research evolving in this particular area? Of course, first of all, R and D, what we call as research and development, that has a tremendous chance because the new technology they are coming, so there will be many, uh, I mean, you know, futuristic application. Now, young minds are always welcome because they come with fresh ideas. So sometimes. we get stuck in some uh, orthodox idea that these are the ways that one should work so we should only look at only these particular areas but whenever a fresh mind comes with some new idea we should encourage them and they i mean no one knows and there are chances of failure of course but that means if there is a chance of failure there is also a possibility of being successful and so we should not ignore that part and i think students should i mean that's what i also tell in the class that you know don't only look at uh, the conventional ways of career i mean they are important we should follow them 
but if you have some better idea some idea that is not so orthodox or not falling in the in the line so if you are feel that you are an outlier among your friends don't discourage yourself we should churn out those ideas that may or rather sh- i mean i am very confident they will do work thank you very much sir thank you for your time